Hey guys, a Potter friend here. So I just decided something new today. I think every day from now on, I will be posting a new video on Saturday, and sometimes in between the week, in in between the weekends, like from Sunday through Friday, I might also upload some extra videos. But for sure, every Saturday there will be a new video. Okay, just wanted to let you guys know that, and. This today I'm going to be talking about this board game, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone trivia game. I got this at the flea market also for only three dollars, which is quite a bargain. So this is the back of it. It's basically just a trivia game where you answer questions like any other trivia game. Um, this board game is pretty similar to the other one I showed you in my other video. The pieces are wizard hats, as you can see, right there. Unlike the other board, um, this one actually has all the pieces, which is why it's probably $3 <laughs> instead of one. So this is the side of the box. I don't know how much you can find this online for. I think I'll look that up and put the information in the description box below yeah okay um let me open up the box for you guys now oh gosh i'm gonna have to put the camera down real quick again sorry okay so i've got the lid off right there so um this is basically the inside. We have um, this row right here where the hats basically go. And the cards. So included in this game are the game board. I'll show you guys that right now. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer Stones trivia game. So I'm not quite sure how to play this yet because I haven't played it yet. Um, it's just been sitting here after I bought it. But I'll record the the, the descriptions of the manual so you guys can read it if you want by pausing the video. Okay, so that's the game board. Next, we have the special six-sided die, which is this die right here. This one doesn't have the Hogwarts emblem like the other dice, but it's still cool. So, this one also doesn't go by the regular six numbers, which is weird. So, we have the sorting hat cards. Four of them, right there. So, let me show you guys those. It's basically these four cards right here. And each of them represent a house. Which is basically the house you will be sorted in in the game, I suppose. Next are the six movers which are these hats they also have stars and moons on them and I think this set we're going with golden black theme here so there are the hats the next one is the trivia box, which contains 168 question cards. That's basically this box right here. Very thick, many cards. I'll show you guys one. Um, so it has the questions, the questions on one side, and 
the answers on the other. And I actually sat down and counted all these cards to make sure everything was in there. And yeah, I do have 168. The next item should be the charm cards, which are 50 of them. And those cards are basically... Um, these cards right here. These are the charm cards. Oh, darn, I spelled it. Okay, let me just clean this up. There you go, the charm cards. They're purple on one side, and on the other side they have the trunk, owl, wand, cauldron, things like that. The next thing are the 50 spell cards, which are blue. On one side it says spell, and the other side it has spells. Next on the list are the curse cards, which are these right here. And they're green, and on the other side there are curses. And the last thing on the list is the double-sided house slash legend cards. Eight of them, which are basically these. They have a house, and they have this, which I'm not sure what it is either. Like I said, I haven't played the game yet. So yeah, that's basically the contents of this box, and here are the directions. If you want to read them, you guys can pause the video. And that's the end of the video. Thank you for watching guys. See you on Saturday.